your favorite bird. I think she knows it too. You think so? Got your fishing rod? Look right here. Ooh, that's nice. This thing goes up and down. Yeah. Saturday, y'all. Me, Sissy, and Mr. Man are going to the grocery store. First, we're going to Tractor Supply, though, because I need to get some chicken feed. We're gonna look at their spring stuff while we're in here. They probably have some spring stuff out. After that, we're going to Aldi, then we're going to Ingles. And we're at Tractor Supply. We're at Tractor Supply, that's right. Look at these little farm gloves, those are cute. You want some farm gloves, Manny? No. I'm no, not. okay. Make yourself at home. What does this blue one say? Hello there with a bird. Yellow says visit anytime with a bird. Purple says love you more. I have these big coffee mugs too. Ooh, $12.99. We'll wait for clearance on that. Is this a candle? Yeah, these are candles. Flower market and oh, they're both flower market. They smell really good. Solar lanterns. That's pretty. Those are pretty. Little boxes. Little recipe box. I think it's like a recipe box. Coffee mugs. Turtle bell, look at that, it's a little turtle bell. They have these three tiered planters, they're 60. Rooster wall planter for $19.99. Uh, this is where I got the rooster wind chime that we have. I don't see one now, but they have lots of different ones. They even have some solar powered ones that light up. Lots of different planters. Oh look, Manly, we could put this guy on one of our trees. What do you think? Ooh. <laughs> Happy chicks live here. Warning, attack rooster. They have some cute little chicken cups down here. Every birdie welcome. My roost, my rules. Chicken crossing, that's cute. We can put that on our chicken pants. Mm -hmm. All the seeds are coming out. Oh look, there's 20, uh, those are 25% off. We've got some new spoon rests. Those are really pretty. Oh, look at this. Is that the only design? Yeah. That's really pretty. Till the cows come home. So many reasons to be happy. Gather somewhere else. <laughs> That's a pretty cow picture. Oh, they have a bell. Iron cow bell. This is pretty. It's like a, looks like an old milk jug. Recipe box. Oh look, it comes with recipe cards too. And it matches that. These towels, they kind of look like bandana style. Kitchen towels. I have a bandana. Yeah, you do have one, don't you? Oh, these are pretty. Oh, we're riding a bike. Y'all, can you even look at that? Fresh eggs, metal farmhouse egg holder. It? They have some new egg trays. These are pretty. Pretty coffee wow. mug. Spring colored chickens. Fresh eggs. It's all about family. What do these say over here? Love your flock. Eggs from spoiled hens. Welcome and bless our kitchen. I'm trying know. to make sure is this the pellets or is it crumble? Because I don't like crumble. It's crumble. Yep, we don't like crumble. They end up wasting the crumble. They're out of the pellets. This is our favorite brand, the Nature Wise, not sponsored. <laughs> but it is our favorite uh, chicken feed brand. I guess we'll have to go with this. Next stop, Aldi. And I forgot to tell y'all what I did this morning. Okay, if you missed the video a couple of videos back, I was telling y'all how I think I have spring fever. I've been joking with Tyler about it. Tyler loves Bonanza. And there's an episode where Hoss has spring fever, okay? And so he's messing up everything. Like every single thing he does, he messes stuff up. He gets people hurt. Like he crushed the sheriff's hand. How did he do that? I can't remember for sure, but he crushed the sheriff's hand. So then he has to, anyway, it's this big deal where he's messing everything up, right? That's been happening to me for about the past week. And this morning, Titus and Tyler and Jake are working on a towel stand for the boys' bathroom upstairs. So they were out in the garage working on that towel stand. And for some reason, they wanted to bring the it into the laundry. <laughs> When the woke one, Mama was opening the yes. door 
and she walked in there then. So. I broke a window. I yeah. sure did. To the door that goes from the laundry room to the back porch. We never used that door. And it was like this happened in slow motion, y'all. I opened the door and Jake was standing there eating popcorn because we had popped some popcorn to go with our sandwiches for lunch. <laughs> so Jake's standing there eating popcorn. When I opened the door, I didn't know he was there and it scared me because it was like open, there's popcorn eating Jake. And I was like, ah, and the door hit the towel stand, which was not put together all the way. They were just having it right there doing something with it. I don't know, but it hit it and then it started falling and it seriously felt like it happened in slow motion. And I was like, Jake, like trying to tell him to grab it before it fell because I thought it was put together and I thought it was going to fall and break. I thought it was put together. It wasn't put together, but it fell and it hit the window on that door and it and busted the window. It broke. Yes, I shattered it. Just one of the little... That's how this day started. Well, it was lunchtime, but up until lunchtime, I was doing pretty good, I think. Did I do something else earlier? I think it's been pretty good up until then. Let's go into Aldi and see if I can manage to not knock anything over or embarrass myself. <laughs> very, very clumsy. More clumsy than usual is happening to me, so we're blaming it on spring fever. <laughs> okay, Manny's gonna be the keeper of the quarter. You got it? Mm-hmm. Hold my hand. Don't lose it. You gotta put it in the buggy when we get up here. Right here. Let's take that one out. <laughs> can we take this one out? Yeah, you can take that one out if you want to. Oh, oh that one's still got one too. You can put it in the next one. Okay. Put it in that one. Yep, there we go. We're going this way. Some pretty spring porch signs. Hello, spring. Oh, this one's pretty. Oh, it says go away. It's pretty, but not nice. <laughs> Hanging basket. Those are $5.99. Narrow organizing bins. How much are these? I'm not sure. A lot of stuff it doesn't have the right price on it right now, but they have those. And these stacking bins here. How much are these? I don't know. Is this them? Oh, they're $4.49. Oh, can I knock out one? They're for big? Yeah, they're for big, big hands. Your hands aren't that big yet, are they? No. A handheld wet dry vacuum. Mm -hmm. Cordless, $24.99. Hey, that's my size. Yeah. Bamboo baskets. They are $9.99. Oh, look, it's a hat washer. If you want to wash your hat, you put it in there. Uh, wash this hat. Yeah, does your hat need washing? Yeah. Looks like it does. <laughs> they have some new candles over here. Cucumber, mint leaf. Rock salt, peppercorn, coconut grove. Oh, coconut grove smells good. We've tried that one before last summer, I think. This ottoman is $34.99. That's pretty too. Speckled trays for $4.99. Titus has been asking for crepes. So I think I'm gonna get this large pancake pan because it'll be the perfect size. Oh, look, they have peanut butter bunny cereal. I'm gonna try this Chipotle ranch dressing, I think. They have dill pickle cashews. I love cashews. Back here are the dill pickle ones. Mama Chili lime, the eye. salt Boy. and pepper, Mama. honey roasted, and coconut. Have y'all tried the coconut ones? I wonder if those would be good. They have the Kara Kara. I love these oranges. Mama. member reward this week is Pringles for 98 cents. They have pizza one right here, Sissy. Or oh, those are ranch. Those are, you want ranch or pizza? Pizza. Okay. Hostess things are buy one, get one free here. Keebler cookies are on sale for $1.98. Lux beans are on sale for 58 cents each. I usually make dry beans, but this is a good deal. We'll get some of these great northern ones too. Dolly's coconut cake is on closeout. I forgot to get vegetable oil at Aldi and I was like, man, I'm gonna have to pay a lot for it here, but it is on sale in Crisco too. Okay, y'all, 
we're back. I'm gonna show y'all another out of the bag haul here. That way I can just put it up as I show you what we got. They're changing the wax seal in my bathroom and doing something with the plumbing down there. So they had to turn the water off for a minute. So they're gonna be in and out like crazy and it might get loud. So I'll just show y'all everything as I put it up real quick. From Ingles, we got rice. Pringles, I showed y'all these in the store. They were the Ingles Advantage member reward for the week. Just 98 cents each. There was a limit of two though. So we got barbecue and pizza flavored. Powdered sugar. I didn't get powdered sugar from Aldi because that's one of the things from Aldi that we don't like. Their powdered sugar has a little bit of a weird taste. It depends on what you're doing with it, but if you're making any kind of icing or glaze or something, every time we've gotten the Aldi powdered sugar, it tasted a little funny. Could have just been ours. I don't know. The Keebler cookies were $1.98 a pack. We got Chips Deluxe. The kids wanted some toaster strudels. These were on sale for $2.78. So I got some strawberry ones. Totino's pizzas were on sale three for five. We got sausage, pepperoni, and combo. What? I love those you love these kind? I got another one of these country white loaves from Ingles. This week I'm gonna make the cubed French toast and I'm gonna use that. I got it to do last week, I think. We ended up using it for some supper we ate. We had that bread with it. I got this garlic toast. I got bananas from Ingles because that's another thing from Aldi. Their bananas are either extremely green and you have to wait several days before they're ready or they're really already turning brown. So I just usually wait and get Ingles from uh, Ingles, bananas from Ingles or Walmart. I got some tomatoes, habanero peppers. Walmart does not have these peppers, neither does Aldi. So I get them from Ingles. Of course, we're gonna be growing some more of these again this year. Ours never did turn orange though. I left those things on there forever and they never turn orange. <laughs> Somebody said there is a green kind and Ingles sometimes has green ones. I just got one gallon of milk from Ingles because I got some from Walmart earlier this week. Got a five pound bag of potatoes. Yo Crunch was on sale. I can't remember if these were buy one get one free or if they were just like a set price. I think they were two, two, they were two something. Got the M&M ones and Oreo. Here is the meat that we got. Steaks, I got some ground beef ribs and the pork chops that we'll be having tonight with the steaks. Got some steak sauce. This is the Laura Lynn, but it's like A1 steak sauce and oil. I showed y'all that in the store. Now, these are the last Ingles bags. I got a few cans of Deluxe beans, two Great Northern, and then four Pinto beans. Cause like I said, that's a great deal. 58 cents a can for Lux. If I didn't make dry beans so much, I would have just gotten a lot of these. Cause that's stock up price right there. The Smithfield bacon was on sale. So I got some of this cherry wood smoked hot links sausage, ham for sandwiches. And I did get some of the pickle loaf. I wanna see if Titus has ever tried it. And if he hadn't, we're gonna make him try this pickle loaf. Then we got some cucumbers and radishes for the cucumber radish salad tonight. <laughs> Moving on to Aldi, if I can hold on to everything. We've already opened some of this stuff. The spicy kettle cooked chips, y'all know we love these. Welch's fruit snacks, it's the spring ones with the chicks and bunnies and eggs and everything. Kids already had some of those and the peanut butter bunnies. These are so good. I walked past them and I was like, nah. And then I turned around and looked back at them and I told Sissy, get those bunnies. And they're individually wrapped little bunny bunnies. They're so good, I already ate one when we got home. We got the dill pickle cashews. Got this pan, make some crepes in the morning or maybe some morning. I don't know if we'll do that in the morning because that takes a little while. Tomorrow is Sunday morning, always a busy morning. So I might do something a little quicker than the crepes in the morning. We'll see how early I get up. I got some old fashioned oats because I used all the ones that I had the other morning when I made the oatmeal. And then these are our favorites, chewy dipped peanut butter granola bars and these pastry crisps. I got two boxes of the blueberry. They're like the special K pastry crisps, but I've tried the special K ones. Crisps is a hard word to say sometimes. I've tried the special K ones. They used to have a lemon one that was pretty good, but their strawberry ones, I don't love their strawberry ones. These Aldi ones are much better. We got a box of the strawberry and two boxes of the chocolate. The blueberry ones are my favorite though. That's the peanut butter bunny song. Then we have some bread, bagels. Sissy said they wanted plain. I asked if they wanted blueberry or plain. She said plain. We already have some strawberry. It's either strawberry or mixed berry. Cream cheese here for those. Baby pickles, blackberries, and celery. Did I just drop some celery? Well, what's Sissy's little heart? Yeah, bless her little heart, huh? 
her fort. We've been having so much rain, her fort fell down. Jonah's helping her build another one, I think. We got onions, the Cara Cara oranges. These are so good, y'all. They're pink inside or like red inside. They're great. Lemons. I ran off and forgot my Aldi bag, so that's why I did that last week too. We got some white cheddar popcorn. Some of this pimento cheese with peppers. I think that's gonna be really good. We, I've gotten this from uh, Ingles before, like a, I think it's the Laura Lynn brand, the pimento cheese with peppers, and it's really good. So we're gonna try the Aldi pine. We got some applewood smoked Gouda. We got some Colby Jack and Pepper Jack. We still have cheese from the cheese stock up that we did from Ingles. I got two bags of this garlic chicken. We got a big box of spring mix. Last bag, we have the peanut butter bunnies. I got two packs of flour tortillas because breakfast burritos are really big around here right now. I made them yesterday morning for breakfast. I think that was the second time this week I made them and I made them last week. Everybody's wanting breakfast burritos. I got some of these cheese and garlic croutons and some of this Chipotle Ranch dressing. That's it. They are about to start striking up the grill, so we need to get this cucumber and radish salad made. We're gonna slice up these three cucumbers. I have some potato salad left over from last night too. So we've got those, and we have this other half of a red onion. 